The Warszawa Army was one of the Polish armies to take part in the Polish Defensive War of 1939. Created on 8 of September, eight days after the invasion begun, it was an improvised formation charged with the defense of the Polish capital of Warsaw. Forces as of 31st of August and German plan of attack. Forces as of 14th of September with troop movements up to this date. Forces after 14th of September with troop movements after this date to defend the Polish capital Warsaw in the face of breakthrough by the German forces. On September 3, 1939 the Minister of the Army, General Tadeusz Kasprzycki, ordered General Valerian Zuma to organize a force to defend the city of Warsaw against a German attack. The city had been under constant attack by the Luftwaffe since the early morning of 1st of September. Initially the only organized units available to him were four infantry battalions, anti-aircraft artillery and anti-aircraft machine guns detachments under Colonel Kazimierz Buran. Composed mostly of firefighter brigades and volunteers supervised by Colonel Tadeusz Bogdanowicz and Julian Kulski, the deputy president of Warsaw. The AA artillery had 86 pieces of anti-aircraft artillery, as well as an unknown number of anti-aircraft machine guns. In addition there was an Air Force Pursuit Brigade which was equipped with 54 fighter aircraft. On the 5 and 6 of September the Air Force and 11 batteries of anti-aircraft artillery were withdrawn to Lublin. Initially however parts of various army units, primarily of Wuj Army, retreating before the onslaught of German armor units, were added to his force. On 8 September General Julius Rommel, the commander of the Wuj Army who had become separated from his operational units, arrived in Warsaw with his staff. The Chief of Staff of the Polish Armed Forces, General Wacław Staszewicz, appointed him the overall commander of all forces defending Warsaw, including the Warsaw Defense Force, the Moblin Fortress and the army units immediately south and northeast of Warsaw during the next days. Army units retreating in face of the onslaughts of the German armor and under continuous air attacks, fought their way through the German lines to the besieged capital, in particular from the Battle of Zura. After 13th of September Warsaw and Modlin were effectively surrounded. The only way the Polish units were able to reach the besieged area was through the Campinos Forest between Warsaw and the Vistula River. On 22nd of September German forces cut through the remaining lines of communication between Warsaw and Modlin. On 26th of September, after heavy bombardment had cut off water and the civilian population was starving, the city was forced to surrender. On 28th of September the Polish forces in Warsaw capitulated. Fort Modlin capitulated the following day. Commander, General Julius Rommel Chief of Staff, Kal Alexander Proglowski Deputy Commander, General Tadeusz Kutrzeba, was Commander of Army Poznan, reached Warsaw 16th of September. Commander of Warsaw Garrison, Valerian Zuma Commander, General Valerian Zuma, Elements of Army Poznan Elements of Army Palmer's Commander, 5th of September Lieutenant. Colonel. Julian Janowski, from 15 September General. Julius Zulauf Elements of Army Modlin Commander, General. Victor Thami, after 12th of September. Elements of Modlin Army Elements of Poznan Army and Palmer's Army remains arrived from the Battle of Bzura after 18th of September. Elements of Wuj Army arrived on 13th of September. Thanks for watching.